Goodbye, puzzle. Good morning, everybody. Today is January 8th, and come along cleaning with me. Cleaning the bathroom, doing the laundry. Let's do it together. Come on. It's not a game, it's a red thing. halfway through I'm going to fill up this with compost here is my one-eyed compost Malone I'll just fill it up this smells like poop disgusting let's go put it in the loamy so this is pretty full but um, I didn't want to have any more compost in there. There she goes. Time to switch the laundry around. Look at how much lint is on this thing. Wow. 
Linty. Ah. Gotta put this all back on my bed. So I will just go chuck it on there right now. Put this in the dryer. new towels so I'm gonna wash these hopefully it doesn't turn everything black then I have one more load of laundry to do after that which is my clothes And then I'm officially done laundry. Well, good morning, everybody. Today is January 9th. Yesterday I did so much. I actually had a high caffeinated tea yesterday and I was able to sleep last night, so yay! So I might be able to drink more high caffeinated teas when I have a really busy day. Cause the high caffeinated tea is my favorite tea. It's the um, Earl Grey one so good so good anyways i wanted to chat about something it's a little tmi if you want to skip through the tmi thing go ahead i was hoping that if someone else is struggling with this that they would be able to help me a little bit i've been struggling with ringworm which is an fungal infection for about six to seven years now. It's been on and off. It's like it lays dormant and then it comes up. Awful. I hate it. Absolutely the worst. I spent so much time trying to find products that work for me and for the ringworm. I have, but they're expensive. They're from the US. It's just so much money and I've bought other pairs of pants to wear to work so I'm not wearing the same pair of pants to work every single day. It's costing me so much money in the last six years. I treat it every single day, even if I don't have the ringworm at the moment. Every single day, it is starting to come back again. And it's, it pisses me off because I, every single day try my best for it to not to come back but it comes back i've been to the doctor three or four times saying that this is happening and they just keep giving me pills or cream for it 
they haven't done any like biopsy on it being like oh what's wrong with your skin maybe we can try something else no so i haven't been to the doctor to tell them because i feel like that's all they're gonna do treat me the way i'm treating myself for it is creams i've been using powders at night after i get out of the shower shower i've been using creams during the day i've also been using a balm from the usa i bought four small bombs for 80 dollars that product works the best so i'm grateful for that but i'm looking for something naturally made in canada so it's not as expensive. If anyone could help me with this situation, it would be appreciated. So I was going through my photos and I want to do a little slideshow of what happened in 2022. So here it is. <laughs> Look at how cute she is. everybody it is 8 30 in the morning and i just woke up 30 minutes ago i woke up at eight o'clock today is tuesday i get an extra day off today so i got to sleep in so that was very nice i went to bed at like nine o'clock last night i had 11 hours sleep however i did wake up at like 11 something there was like a huge bang i was like it scared the shit out of me because I was in a dream as well. And I didn't know if it was in my dream or if it was here or upstairs. And 
I turned on the light because I was scared. I woke up Steven. I'm like, I'm sorry I got scared. And he's like, oh, what happened? And I was like, there was a huge bang and I don't know where it came from. And then in my head, like I heard people like walking upstairs. And then I was thinking that it was demons like walking against the walls. And I'm like, why the fuck would I think that? <laughs> why would I put my brain through that? <laughs> we got up. And we looked around, make sure that everything was okay. Everything was okay. And then we went back to bed. And I left the light on for a little bit longer. And then I fell asleep. And then I woke up. And I was like, okay, I should turn the light off. But I've had, I had so many dreams last night. And I don't know why. And they were all stressful. All stressful dreams. Steven and I did finish the Star Wars puzzle last night. The Clone Wars puzzle. And... It was so much harder than the Pokemon puzzle. There was so much like black on the bottom and then so many like orange stars at the top and black and purple and whatever. And I was like, oh my God. But I think we are going to try a thousand piece puzzle because a 500 piece puzzle takes us about three to four days to do. So we're thinking that a thousand piece puzzle will take us maybe a week or so. Anyways, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed the slideshow. I enjoyed putting it all together. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, turn on post notifications so you know when I post a video. And I will see you guys in the next video on Thursday. Bye.